What is behind door number one? Anybody here? I can't. I can't think about them in here. That's a pretty bad mess. It's going to a pretty dark place. How you doing? Okay. <laughs> Good. <laughs> You're all I've got in this world now, Clementine. My father's pool cue. What's that? This was my dad's cane. That was close. He'd zip around here on it from time to time. Was he sick? Nah, he was okay. I actually saw him whoop shoplifters with it. <laughs> this cane's protected this place better than any guard dog ever could. Plus, he knew how to make it look cool. Like you with your hat. My dad gave it to me. See, dads are smart like that. <laughs> I'm gonna start crying again. We ought to clear this door for when we find the keys. I ought to clear a path to opening that door. Okay. I want to explore a bit more. First aid kit. Luckily, there's nothing I need in here. Let's go into the alley then. This door leads to the back alley. Alright, so I can't go in. The music in this game is really cool. I don't really know what I'm supposed to be doing in here. I ought to clear oh, a path right, to right. open in that See, door. I'm still getting to grips with the controls after over an hour of Better play. Get this door clear, huh? Can I help? Sure. Here we go. Watch your fingers in the drawers. Time for some small talk. <clears throat> Things have been scary, huh? Yeah. It's not good. I don't know why everyone is crazy. Neither do I, Clementine. Nobody does, I don't think. I bet my dad does. Okay, here we go. I can really relate to this story. This is very similar to what it was like when Riley found me in my treehouse. Do you have kids? No. You don't have a family? Not anymore! <laughs> Let's not talk about that. Do you play sports? I play soccer, but I don't really like it. I'm not crazy about it Smart either. Smart girl. Alright, a little further. <sighs> Why don't you want to talk about your family? Do they, like, hate you? Yeah, I'm not going to say it's because they're dead. I wouldn't blame them. Why? Did you fight? I fight with my mom sometimes. We didn't fight. We just didn't talk for a while. Look, my family's gone and I just wish things would have been different. Yeah. Oh. Just go with the first one. I got into some trouble and, and I didn't talk to him for a while. This used to be their store. But let's just keep that between you and me, okay? Okay. Because of the trouble? Yeah, that's right. Now, uh, let's get this done. It's me and you against the world. Ow! You idiot! Are you okay? I hurt my finger. Is it bleeding? A little. I'll find you a bandage. I know just where to look. There's a band-aid in there, I bet. Oh, good.
one band-aid coming up. Dad kept the remote for that thing in here someplace. I'll look for that in a minute. I'm really liking this game. Lee? Yeah? What if my parents come home and I'm not there? They'll find us. They'll uh, track us down. Yeah, I'm really Don't liking work. this game. It was it was a little bit yeah. slow getting into okay. it, but I well, really like it. We should keep a lookout. I've got my walkie-talkie in case they try that way. Stay close to me until then, okay? Uh, drawer. The remote. Well, there was a remote in there. It's the remote to my dad's TV. <laughs> All I have left of him. That and his cane. And his blood. That's what I figured. Hmm. What else is there? My pants came in here hoping to survive. But it looks like one of them was hurt. I wonder if it was my dad. <laughs> Trying to be a hero, maybe. Or a protector, at least. Sounds like a good guy. Oh, come on, I'm gonna start crying. <laughs> Tugging on my heartstrings here. Much better. Find anything? Just a picture. Just a picture of whoever was here. I know who you are. <gasps> You're Lee Everett. You're a professor at Athens who killed a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. This is your parents' Wow. Star. Folks around town know the owner's son Clementine, got himself cover your ears. I don't want you to hear this. But I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. I paid attention to that trial. Maybe you're a murderer, but I don't really care. Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. <laughs> Did you tell anyone out there who you were or that you were tied to this place? Of course not. I didn't even know. <laughs> Uh, it's the apocalypse, who cares? The world is ending out there. Who cares who I am? If you don't think people will find any reason to turn on you, especially when the shit hits the fan, you're insane. Whatever. Whatever. You seem like an okay guy, and the last thing we need is drama out there. You've got this little girl to take care of, and... Look, don't make me wrong on this. I don't plan to. Good. Because if this lasts longer than a few days, and you're a detriment to the group, then we'd have a problem. I hear you. I'll just keep it to myself. Thanks. Thanks. Don't worry about it. I made a friend. But that was a pretty big bit of story. My wife was sleeping with a United States Senator, so I killed him. Once again, not that far off from my own life. Anyway, we can get out this door now. That's the door to the pharmacy. We should be able to find pills for Larry in there. Okay, check on Clementine before I go. Let's have a look at that finger. Oh, I totally forgot. How? Oh. It hurt. Let's see if we can do something about it. Pliers? <laughs> uh... Let's get this cut covered up. Yes, please. I'm a hero! Freelance medicine man. Okay, pharmacy. Drugs? Yeah, I really like this game. This is. does need more games like this because it's maybe lacking a little bit on the gameplay side, but the story is good. I'm getting involved. It's locked. We need to track down the keys if we're gonna help Larry. God damn it. Keys, keys. Where would the keys be? My pants came in here hoping to survive. But it looks like one of them was hurt. I wonder if it was my dad. <laughs> Trying to be a hero, maybe. Or a protector, at least. Uh... 
Have you heard from Glenn? Not in a little while. Everyone out there seem all right to you? Yeah. Well, maybe not the sick guy. Yeah. We'll keep an eye on him. And there was that thing in the bathroom. It tried to get me. I know. But you stopped it. Yeah, I did. Can you do that more? Well, I'm not gonna go looking for them. I mean, get the dangerous ones. I'm gonna try. Good. I'm certainly gonna try, Clementine. I'll certainly try. How's your thing? It's okay. I need Thanks to find for the fixing keys. <laughs> no problem, but I need to find these keys. I'm gonna keep looking around. Okay. Sure this will be one of those times where everybody is screaming. They're right there, you idiot! Luckily, there's nothing I need in here. Where's the goddamn keys? Want to head back into the drugstore with me? Okay. Lee? Yeah? You're not bad, right? I... Uh, why are you asking me that? That lady said you killed someone. I told you to cover your ears! Because he was one of the things trying to eat you? In a way. <laughs> yeah, he was. And you had to protect yourself. That's right. Oh, okay. The only thing that matters in this game so far is that I have not killed Clementine. But the night is young. Keys. I need keys. We just need Ice to cream. get back to Fort It's all melted now. We'll do our damnedest. <laughs> we'll do our damnedest to get that ice cream going again. I will yes, not rest until you. there's ice cream in this store. Oh, thanks, Lee. He appreciates it. Not sweet, Lee. Hey there. Uh, this is Glenn, and uh, I'm kind of in a jam here. Uh, little girl, if you're there, can you put your daddy on the phone? Or on the talkie, or whatever? She's not my daughter. This is Lee. What's up? <laughs> so, I'm down at that motor inn, and, well, uh, I'm stuck. Stuck. Yeah, I uh, uh, saw a chance to get some supplies for the group, and a bunch of the Roman ones got the jump on me. I'm hiding over here, but they won't leave. What's up? Glenn's trapped down at the motor inn. Uh, hey, crap. Dad, we're gonna talk it over and send a group to come get you, all right? <sighs> awesome. I'll sit tight till then. Sounds good. Somebody's gonna speak up. I'm we can't go get him. It's not worth the risk. Back, okay. I'll take good care of it. What do you think? I think Doug's not great around zombies, and you got your family here. I'll take Carly and her dead eye down to the motor inn, get Glenn, and get back here as fast as I can. If that's what you want to do, somebody's got to. Yeah, I'm in. Good. Doesn't sound too bad there right now. Let me know as soon as you want to head out. I could use a jog. Excellent. I'll just gather up some supplies. I really need to find those keys, though. How's he doing? I'm not sure I got your name. It's Lee. Lily. My dad's Larry. Let's try and keep this friendly, okay? I did not give your dad a heart attack. I was doing what I had to earlier. Everyone was. Now his heart's acting up again and I'm powerless to do anything. And that violence before with my dad? That didn't help. You're from here? I work at Warner Robins, the Air Force base. Yeah, I know it. Pilot? Nah, just mechanical oh, pilot. admin stuff. Amateur. I deal with a bunch of shitheads and bureaucrats all day. Sometimes a plane, if I'm lucky. You? I work up at UTA. I did. Eh... Uh, is anyone was there? Was anyone here when you guys got here? No, this place was pretty wrecked. We pulled a couple of bodies out of the office. Oh my god. That's my Are mama, you okay? papa you're talking about! Yeah, I'm fine. Did you know anybody here? Yeah, the owners, they were, uh, we were close. 
I'm sorry. We found an older couple in the office. Dad hauled them out in case they weren't really dead. I think I'm gonna be sick. I'm gonna get back to him. Sounds good. Let's give them an energy bar. It's not much, but here. You sure? Yeah. You're under quite a bit of stress. Thanks. You could use an energy That's, bar. Uh, really sweet. Don't mention it. Possible love interest for Lee there. It's not damaged. Glad this place didn't get looted. Where's the door? Excuse me, Clementine. Try to get some rest, hon. How can I with those things out there? I said go to sleep, damn it! I don't remember them very well. Remember who? I can't see the pictures. Greetings cards. No, I'm sorry to hear your loved one was eaten by the living dead card. I don't get it. What else can I do while looking for the keys? What are you messing around with there? A radio. I can't get it to work though. Here, let me have a look. I can fix the radio. There are no batteries in this thing. What now? <laughs> you know that there are no batteries in that thing. Yeah, of course. I mean, yeah. No. I can try to find some. Needs two. Thanks. I wouldn't even really know what to look for. <laughs> I find it terrifying that someone who can't figure out this radio has no batteries in it is allowed to operate Looks like nobody got a chance to donate anything before this all went down. So now I'm looking for batteries and keys. It's locked. We need to track down the keys if we're going to help Larry. I don't know where they are. Dad told me he bought that TV to watch baseball in here, but I caught him watching his stories more than a few times. That's what I figured. I would like to apologize to anyone who is still watching this boring episode. I'm sure whatever I need to do is really obvious, but I can't figure it out. This is probably pretty painful viewing. But let's look at the positives. The game looks really cool, and the longer I struggle, the longer we get to listen to the soundtrack, because the music in this game is pretty good. My parents came in here hoping to survive, but it looks like one of them was hurt. I wonder if it was my dad. <laughs> Trying to be a hero, maybe. Or a protector, at least. I'm gonna keep looking around. Okay.
One way or another, I will figure this out. <laughs>